Cleveland's really moving from what was once a rust belt city to a green city on a blue lake and thriving in economic development, community engagement, and sustainability. The Council Smaller Enterprise is also known as COSI, is Ohio's largest small business support organization. Specifically over the last 15 years, we have been representing businesses uh, on the energy efficiency front to create strategic procurement opportunities. And with that, we've also been at the table to ensure that small businesses have a voice when it comes to the utilities. As a result of the utility programs, we've been able to help small businesses capture over $4 million last year alone in utility rebates. On average, businesses were finding and realizing about a 23 to 25% energy savings overall. In addition, we also helped over 200 businesses conduct an energy assessment last year uh, at either a free audit cost because of the utility program or at a subsidized rate. The business case that we make to small businesses as it relates to energy is that it's money back in their pocket. It quickly can resonate to their bottom line and without getting all warm and fuzzy and talking anything with uh, the words of green or sustainability. If it makes business sense to them and it speaks to their operating expenses, that's what hits their pain points. Another opportunity that we're really diving deep into is in the green leasing space. So we're driving that dialogue to remove that split incentive that may exist between the landlord and the tenant to create a shared savings so that energy efficiency projects can be something that is on the horizon for small businesses. But as energy prices continue to increase, businesses will be looking for solutions. And so it's critical to identify ways in which we can engage small businesses now in the dialogue, continually educating them with those quick hit solutions that, that they can start to embrace now. Not everyone has it figured out, uh, but together we have a stronger voice when it comes to policy and legislation and looking at initiatives that can drive economic development for chambers across the United States.